What's happening, everyone? Bowling back here with Real Breaks, ready to do Bowman's Best. It's been a little while since we've done some Bowman's Best. But here we are, a little random division. I have two cases in front of me. If somebody could pick either left or right, I would greatly appreciate it, and then we'll get rolling. Left or a right? We got a right. We got a right. Thank you, Justin. We will save the left for a later date. Here we go. Move that. I'm gonna try to keep everything together by division so when we do the recap, be able to just go right by division, show each of you guys what you're gonna be bringing home. So that's what I'm gonna be shooting for. Say hello when you drop in the chat. Let me know who's hanging out with us at 1.10 Central Time in the morning. <laughs> it's gonna be good, Justin. It's gonna be good. Trust me. I have a good feeling. Oh, a really nice day overall. I think we end up we end on a high note here. It's been a really good day. Definitely can't complain. Tomorrow, on the other hand, when I gotta go back to work, then I can complain. Did you got one of them? <laughs> Did you get the AL Central? Oh, you got the East, huh? Looking for some Dominguez. Let's see if we can get you a little Jason. Josh has got the NL Central. I like the NL Central a lot in this, too. Because NL Central, you got Gary Mitchell, Eddie Howard, the Chase, Kino, you got Nick Gonzalez as well. So we're here for, John. Some nice entertainment. That's what I love about this group. There's a Kelnick. That's what I love about this group. It doesn't matter if you're in a break or not. Oh, I didn't even know Austin Hendrick had autos in this. Austin Hendrick base auto. Yeah, it doesn't matter if you get in breaks or if you just hang out and watch. We love having everybody with us. Just some people enjoying some baseball cards. There's a Luis Robert. Aquino. And we got a rookie blue, it looks like. Little Nico Horner. 103 out of 150. And now Central's off to a great start. Nico blue. Bump the Austin Hendrick for that. Little Luis Robert. All right. AL's going on the bottom. Have you not been in a break yet, John? Here, a little Dax Fulton Refractor for the NL East. 
Dax Fulton. NL East. Mike Trout. Nico. Anthony K. Blue Jays. Blue Jays are going to the AL East. Kyle Lewis, rookie refractor. Juan Soto out of 250. Christian Yelich, Atomic. And a Nico base. Paul, what's going on, man? Stopping in to say hi? Oh yeah, we've had a lot of really nice pulls. Our first box, the the Bowman Picker Team, our first break of the day, was absolutely insane. We had uh, in the money mitt, we had a blue Torkelson auto, and then what it bumped out was a gold wave Asa Lacy. Was one that it bumped out. It's going AL West. And then what Asa Lacy, what the gold Asa Lacy bumped out was a black out of 75, Garrett Crochet. Also in that same case, we hit a Ed Howard out of 499. It was nuts. Was it a good break or a bad break that you had with Tom? Case. Who'd you have in it? And what product was it? Some draft? Some Bowman? Two. <laughs> Flipped her right on over to it. Luis Robert Refractor. Big hit. Nice, nice hit. Oops. I don't have my spreadsheet up. Am I supposed to know who that's going to? AL Central to Justin. Justin, you still up? Oh, was a mixer? Now, Paul, it's all because you brought the boom with you, man. You brought the boom with you. Justin was up with us last break, I'm pretty sure. Bobby Witt. There's a Boba Shet base. Who's Robert Paul Producers? And how about a second Nico Horner? Goodness. Central to Josh. I said Josh. You know, at first, I didn't like... I didn't like Luis Roberts Auto at first. But now, it's really kind of growing on me a little bit. Right, Luis Robert. Asa Lacy out of 250. Kind of Lewis space. <laughs> we should probably show up in every break then. Oh shit. Probably should just come and hang out, have fun with us so we can pull Luis Roberts 
all day long. Royals. Ail Central, I believe. Yep. One day I will get these all down. There's only a couple that always give me a little bit of trouble in the divisionals. Houston Astros. I can never remember what division the Houston Astros are in. Um, Mariners is another one. That's pretty much it. It's just AL, AL West. And the Rockies. Rockies I always wonder about too. There's a nice one. Blue. Jaron Duran out of 150. Doing good. Doing really well. Everyone's doing good. Um, did just get some not so good news today as I was breaking. Um, we put in an offer on a house that we really liked and um, my trout refractor and they turned it down. Nice air CS Aquino. Must have got a bigger offer from somebody else. So we got to keep looking. That's okay. Pete Alonzo. It's one you don't see every day. This case is starting off really nice. Um, so yeah, so that was a little bit of a bummer that we weren't able to, uh, that they didn't accept our offer on the house. We actually went, um, quite a bit over what they were asking for. So somebody else probably offered a little bit more. There's what it is. Not going to sleep over it. We got until May before we have to, uh, so I still got until May before we got to be out. Trout refractor. Yeah, well, you know, we live and learn on this one. You know, we actually went higher than what the realtor actually told us to, told us to do. That's all right, though. We continue, we keep looking. We got a couple months before we gotta be out. Josh Bell Atomic. There you go. The solid case. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. Yep. Uh, picks for the Super Bowl. I think it all depends on the Buccaneers defense. All depends on the Buccaneers defense. Because if the Buccaneers defense shows up in place, I think that Tom Brady wins. And if the Buccaneers defense can't shut down Patty Mahomes, then I think that uh, the Chiefs win. Yeah, we're not giving up, that's for sure. And we were actually, this was a little earlier than what we had expected. To actually start throwing out um, offers at people. Because our lease actually isn't actually up until middle of May, I want to say. Yeah, it's middle of May. And if we don't find a house by then, we can go on a month by month lease. It's just a jack of our rental to get higher. Which isn't the worst thing in the world. You know, at least we'll still have a, a roof over our head and stuff like that. That's what I'm thinking, Zach. That's what I'm thinking. Better house is on the way. Chiefs 34-24? Yeah. You know, like I said, I, you know, if the fucking defense can shut them down, you know, keep them down to like 17, 21 points, somewhere around there. I think that, uh, I think the Buccaneers win. It all rests on their defense. Judge out of 150. Let's see, nice. Bryce Harper and uh, Reed Detmers. Tom pulled the super fracture of this one earlier today. Next hit going to the Angels in the AL West. Yeah, I could I could see I could see that John for sure. You know, one score game. Yeah, 
Yeah. Rodgers should have just ran it. All he had to do. Julio Rodriguez, refractor, Trent Grisham, rookie. Aaron Judge, power producers. And how about a, the newest member of the Arizona or the St. Louis Cardinals, a Nolan Arenado. Going to the Rockies in the NL West. Hey, yo, NL West. I'm going to bump the Austin Hendrick. NL West is on the board with a big one. Nobody, if Brady wins this game, nobody will ever touch him as, you know, the greatest player of all time. Nolan Jones and Patrick Bailey Giants Refractor Auto. It's gonna be a really good game, John. Tom already asked, he's like, hey, are you okay if uh, uh if, if you break? I said, yeah, I'll break on Sunday still. It's okay. Not like the Packers are in it anyways. I honestly probably would have broke anyways, even if the Packers were in it. Peter Downs. Yellowish Power Producers and Mauricio Dubon. Base all over the Giants. Garrett Mitchell. Gavin Lux and a Gavin Lux Atomic. Sweet card. Gavin Lux Base. That was a Gavin Lux pack right there. Put those in my sleeve up pile. In Wisconsin. Yes, we are out of Asia in Wisconsin. Um... Minnesota boys, I think, have a couple more, though. And out west. The Minnesota boys should have a few more. Tom might buy some more Asia, though. I enjoy ripping Asia, and it's always... It fills so quickly for a late-night break, too. And actually, I, I didn't know how this would fill, um, you know, for a 1 a.m. break. Then it actually, like, snap filled pretty much. It was full in, like, 10 minutes. I'm like, oh, all right. All right. I was glad this was filled quick. But what's best is fun. I, 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 think, I think the value is still there. Even with the price going a little, going a little high, the value I think is still there for sure. Asia's fun. Asia's really, really fun. I gotta find myself a Garrett Mitchell Asia. They're hard to find on eBay though. Box number four, this is the halfway box here. I like this one. JJ Blade Gold. Cool hit. And now uh, East. Would be nice if there was some ink on that bad boy. Speaking of the NL East, Jared Schuster Refractor Auto. The NL East. Well, Torgelson. Oh, the shit. Oh, 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 boy. That's how we do it, AL East. AL East style. Hmm. Guess I can just put it up there with your Duran, right? 
That's it. Halfway through this case, and this showcase looks awesome. Right there. <laughs> yeah, the, the market cornered. That's how you do it, man. There's a Yordan. That's how you do it, Gaston Kerstad. And it's a beautiful card right here. A green Robert Poussin out of 99. We're ending this night the same way that we started this night. On fire. Ale West on that one. Who um I don't know. Probably Pete Alonzo. Just a base auto Pete Alonzo. Still. Don't want to take anything away from take anything away from Pete. But if you can't do it, you can't do it, right? Like Trump base, Gavin Lux. Nico. Jordan and Tariq Skubal. Base auto to the Tigers and the AL Central. Yeah, we're not even we're not even halfway done yet. You should post that in the group as like a not for sale so we can all uh, we can all be all jealous. Justin Dunn, 50 out of 50 on that one. Max Meyer Atomic. Because, like, not only is it a trout, but it's an Atomic, which is the coolest, in, like, which is the coolest uh, parallel out there, in my opinion. But then, it came back at 9.5. Like, yeah. That's, <laughs> that's pretty awesome. Justin Dunn, 50 out of 50. What did I just drop? I think I dropped my thick sleeves. 50 out of 50, Justin Dunn. AL West. <laughs> I wish I would have got it, and I'm breaking it. I always forget the Orioles are the Ale East. Box five. They either post in the group, Paul, or just send me a picture of it. I want to see it. Like, post it in uh, the marketplace. It is not for sale or for trade. Just showing off a little bit. I just, I just love seeing big cards. I'm gonna go see if Quick Trips open them upon here. I'm hungry. I think I was watching that break too, Paul. Pretty sure I was. Because that was right when I started watching breaks. A lot. I mean, I've been in the group probably since... I think it's May of 19. But I really started watching breaks a lot. Right when Bowman's Best came out. Kino, Lux Refractor, Jordan Rookie, and dude, you're killing it in this Nico spot. Just Nico alone. Nico, rookie out of 99. To the central. Nice stuff. Lux Refractor. People love these refractors. Levine. 
Shohei and a little two hit wit. Wit Maryfield AL Central. Mike Trump. Emerson Hancock Atomic. Acuna Atomic and a Justin Lang base auto. I think every division's got a nice hit so far, too. Both Wests, both Centrals. East and the other East has the, uh, the other East has that uh, Pete Alonzo. Emerson. Yo, Luzardo rookie. Looks extra refractory. Tatis has a boba shit. Pete Alonzo. And how about a double up on Robert Poussin? There you go. Nice hit. Little Robbie. Robert Poussin double up. Robert Bass. He's just Lazardo out of 250. Torkelson Refractor. Oh! Pete Crow Armstrong Bass Auto. Yeah, that'll do. Yeah, every division, every division has done well now. With getting that, uh, that Pete Crow Armstrong right at the end here. Very, very good. Nice hit. And at least three boxes left for the night. What a night of fun, too. A lot of fun tonight. Luis Robert. Boba shit. Torkelson refractor, we'll put that in the sleeve up pile as well. Three boxes left. Three boxes left. Quick trip in the pond here. Has like a burger or something out there for me to enjoy on my ride home. I do do the vintage stuff, Paul. What I'm really hoping, or what I'm really working on right now, and I was working on it before he passed away. And now it's going to be put on hold for a little bit until the buying and selling all settles down. But I am trying to get every single Hank Aaron card from his playing years between 1954 through 1974. So that's uh, that's one of my projects right now that I'm working on. Flipped right over to an auto. Max Muncie. So that's what I'm working on. Like I said, I'm going to have to put it on hold for a little bit. And Dodgers? What about you? Do you do a lot of the vintage stuff too? Oh, Griffey. Gorman Ed Howard Refractor. Cunha and a Logan Webb. 
Always gotta get a Logan Webb. Yeah, it's super tough with his passing. I was trying to, uh, I was really trying to find a good deal on his auto. And ever since, yeah, ever since he passed, his autos and his cards have just gone insane. So I'm hoping that it simmers down a little bit. Bailey at a 150, Tutsugo, Nico, Jeter Downs. You got to meet him, Johnny? I'd have loved to be able to meet, uh, to meet him. Just, uh, like, hearing my dad talk about him made me, made me absolutely love the guy. Sleeve up pile for those guys. So, yeah, when my dad talked about him, just... Made me fall in love with him as a as a player and a person. And that's why I really wanted to start collecting all of his cards and I was, I was doing really well. I actually just picked up his rookie card uh, about two months before. PSA 2 I picked up his rookie card. So I, I was lucky on that timing in that aspect. I just wish he wouldn't have died at all. And there we go. Emerson Hancock. It's our case hit auto. Actually, we got two case hit autos. Emerson Hancock out of 250. And we got a Nolan Aaron Nato out of 99. Power producers. We got two case hits. Ale West. Ale West. Let's just put the Emerson Hancock up there with the Poussins, I guess. Case has been... Straight fire. The trope. Oh, you've been working on maze lately? That's awesome. I've been trying. I've been thinking about getting a maze too, but my time was kind of all taken up with. Uh, there's a Jordan and a Max Meyer. Nice one there too. Uh, my time was kind of all taken up, and I guess my funds with the with the Hank Aaron stuff. Maze is going to be the next one. I should almost switch up to him now for a little while. There's Max Meyer going to the Marlins in the NL East. Yeah, he was an absolutely great person. I wonder I wonder if they're going to do a, like a movie about him. I think they should. I think they most certainly could. He's got enough there. Two boxes left. Bowman. That's one of my favorite sets. I got the uh, the Hank Aaron 55 Bowman. Like the uh, the TV looking thing. I like that one a lot. That's awesome, Johnny. That's really cool. How long ago was that? But this is what I was trying to pull off. Boba Shet Refractor. I did not get any uh, Sapphire. I really wish that I did. But I am not lucky enough to be in the... I'm not, uh, I wasn't fast enough to get into the Montgomery Club this year. So I was kind of left out in the dust. And I definitely don't want to play, pay the, 
the secondary market prices for them. 95 to 96? That's cool. So did he sign your Red Wings jersey then? Because that'd be really cool if you got an autographed Red Wings jersey from Hank Aaron. You were on base. Heston Kirsten at a 250. Patisse, Jordan Refractor rookie. Soto and. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Good lord. Holy cow. Luis Robert out of 150. 43 out of 150. Ooh. Doubling up on Luis Robert is never a bad thing. Holy cow. Heston Kirstad. I would take a handshake from him. I would definitely take a handshake from Hank. Chris Bryant's Atomic. Patrick Bailey double up there. Giants. Hey, isn't that crazy? Two Luis Robert autos. One of them out of 150, one refractor. That's fantastic. It's wild. Oh, that'd be awesome, Paul. You're not. I would, I would definitely enjoy that. Luis Robert, 2020. Boba Shep base. Another rookie auto. Could you imagine if that would have been another one? That would have been insane. This, this, this is a tough one to hit. Brendan McKay does not sign a ton in this product. Nice hit for the AL East. Chippa. Green. Casey Mize. Out of 99. And Nick Yorkie. Base auto. Also going to the AL East. They're all friends of the family? Man, that's awesome. Johnny, you got some connections, man. Got some connections. Casey Pines, Detroit. Now, I really wanted uh, I really wanted a box of Bowman Heritage this year. That's what I was going for. Andrew, you've missed a killer case so far. It's been nuts, man. It's been an absolutely insane case. <laughs> I was actually just saying earlier that I think no matter what, no matter what division somebody got, you did well. You did really well. This is our last, uh, this is the last case here, or the last box, so we're going to recap after this. After this. What did you have? You had NL, NL East and AL West, right? Because this whole showcase right over here, this stand is all big hits for the a or, uh, yeah, AL West. Pusan Green, Pusan Base, and Emerson Hancock out of 250. Just to name a few that are on the showcase. I got all the uh, divisions all separated by hits over here to my right. And we'll be able to go through a, a recap right after this.
for the NL East, I know that you've hit a Pete Alonzo auto. Also a Pete Crow Armstrong auto. And then a Max Meyer for sure. And you just hit yourself a Jordan Yamamoto auto as well. So yeah, I think that every every division has done well in this case. Yamamoto. With Stan Lee too. <laughs> so it's not just baseball. It's everything. Jordan rookie. Nick Gonzalez got a green here. Kate Cavalli. Nice first rounder out of 99. 69 out of 99 on the Cade Cavalli. You know, Andrew. And I'll East again. Jordan. Gavin Lux, rookie. Joey Votto, Atomic. Last stack. Oh, we're going on a super fractor. We got a super fractor to end the night. <laughs> oh, let's go. Elzele. I think I saw who it is. I think I saw it. But I am not sure. If it is who I think it is, if it is who I think it is, this division had an incredible break. Tyler Soderstrom, nice one there too. It's right underneath, right underneath this AJ Puck. Right underneath the AJ Puck. So we, me and Tom, Tom did one case of Bowman's best. I did another case of Bowman's Best. We did two cases of Bowman's Best today. And we pulled a Super Fractor from both cases. I'm going to feel really silly if that isn't actually a Super Fractor underneath there. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure it is. I'm like, yep, that's a Super. <laughs> yep, Indians. Oh, a little Francisco Lindor Super Fractor. Wow. The AL Central just cleaned up in this break. Good lord. That looks so nice, the way that C pops with that Super Fractor. Wow. What a... What a case. Justin Gorman. I think I just became your new best friend, buddy. Ha <laughs> All right, that was that was a heck of a break. That was so much fun. Let's uh, let's get everything together for a recap. Oh my gosh, that was fun. Yeah, Paul, Paul came on and everything just clicked, man. Everything just clicked. So yeah, look at that showcase, really awesome showcase. We're gonna take everything off the showcase, put it into their respective divisions. Arenado. The Rockies are the ones that always, that always give me in trouble. Rockies are NL West. NL West, right there. Red Sox and Orioles, right there. Okay, okay, okay. So in no particular order, we'll start in the same order that we have the division. So Andrew McClay will start off with the NL East. Move. Oh, 
All right. So Andrew McClay with the NL East. Soto out of 250. Blade out of 50. Max Meyer Atomic. Acuna Atomic. Autos Fulton Refractor. Schuster Refractor. Pete Alonzo Base. Pete Tro Armstrong Base. Max Meyer Base. Yamamoto Base. And a Cade Cavalli out of 99. Really nice break there for Andrew in the East. NL Central. NL Central also did really well. Every division, like I said, did well. Yelich Atomic, Aquino out of 150, Josh Bell Atomic, Nico out of 99, green. We got an Austin Hendrick base, Elzole Refractor, Nico out of 150, and a Nico base. Nice break to Josh Hackman. NL West, Ryan. Ryan in the NL West. Gavin Lux Atomic, Lux Refractor, Patrick Bailey out of 150. Patrick Bailey Refractor, Dubon Base, uh, Justin Lang Base, Max Muncy Refractor, Logan Webb Base, Patrick Bailey again, and Nolan Arenado 50 out of 99. On the power producers going to the NL West. And Ryan. AL East to Justin Hackman. We got a judge out of 150, Judge Atomic, Boba Shit Franchise 2020, Kirsten Atomic. Kirsten. Kerstad, Jeter Downs reverse negative, Yoshi Atomic, Boba Shet Refractor rookie, Kerstad out of 250, Autos Anthony K base, Brandon McKay Refractor, Nick Yorkie base, and Jaron Duran out of 150, and Adley Rutschman base auto. Going to Justin Hackman in that AL East spot. I'm going to save the NL Central for last because that is insane. But we also had a really nice break here from the Central as well. Or from, not from the Central, AL West. AL West to Andrew. Mike Trout Refractor, Kyle Lewis Refractor. We got a Justin Dunn 50 out of 50. Jesus Lazardo out of 250. Emerson Hancock Atomic. Jordan Refractor, Jordan Atomic. Reed Detmer's Base Auto. Soderstrom Base, Emerson Hancock out of 250. Pusan and a Pusan ref refractor and a Pusan 16 out of 99 green. Nice break again to Andrew. And this is just this is just filthy. Straight filthiness. Sounds good, Paul. We'll do. We'll do. How about this? AL Central, Justin Gorman, Luis Robert, a couple of rookies, Asa Lacey out of 250, Roberts again. We got Casey Mize out of 99, Tigers, Robert, uh, Autos, Tweak Scooble, Whit Merrifield, two Luis Roberts. You got a Refractor and also a 43 out of 150. And then the big one as well to go along with it. Right down on the bottom, you can see right there, the one of one super fractor, Mr. Smiles himself, Francisco Lindor. That is how we end the night. That is how we do a break. That is fantastic. I just realized I said that a lot. <laughs> but that's going to do it for the night, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. That was a really, really fun break, really fun night. I had a blast hanging out with you all. Um, I got, we got Titus up tomorrow. Morning, uh, 10 o'clock. See you, Andrew. Thanks a bunch. Really do appreciate it. Um, Titus is back tomorrow morning. And then uh, Tom will be back tomorrow night. So come hang out with those guys and have some more fun. See you later, Paul. So I'll talk to you guys later. Have an awesome week. Bye-bye, guys.
Uh, oh, before I go, before I go, sorry, sorry, sorry. I do have to run one random. I totally forgot about, about it. Almost forgot about it. Almost forgot about it. Uh, we had to run a random. Last week we did a contenders break. Uh, contenders football, where we were giving away a Ditka picture. Mike Ditka. Um, and we are going to run that random for that right now. So I'm just going to switch over to my desktop. Run that random. Whoever lands up on top is going to be bringing home the Ditka 8x10. So we had 15 skunks in that one. So here we go. Dice roll four higher on this. Seven. Can't believe I almost forgot to do this. <laughs> Final round, who's ever on top is going to be bringing home the Ditka 8x10. Chargers, the Jordan Larson is going to be bringing home that 8x10. All right, and there we go. That will do it for the night now. All right, guys, thanks a bunch. We'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.